Nature, an open book, and today's chapter is the cell. How many cells do you think are in this fish? Let's take a look. By putting the fish's little tail under the microscope, we can actually see the red blood cells in the tail and watch them move with every heartbeat, both to and from the heart, in the veins and arteries. The fish is returned unharmed. I myself can poke myself in the finger and you see I'm also made of cells same red blood cells about the same size my body is made of about a hundred trillion cells compare the size of this cell to the size of a salt grain the salt grain is so large on this scale that the cell itself is quite small here's another thing you gotta look at a carrot the cells in an average carrot are much larger than a red blood cell. Not every cell is as small as every other cell. Some are larger than others. But how can you imagine how small a cell actually is? Well, the flea is one of the smallest organisms that you can see with a naked eye. And if you were to imagine that a flea had its own flea, well, that will be the size of a cell. Now get ready for the big surprise. Fleas do have fleas, and those are the bacterial parasites that spread the bubonic plague throughout all of Europe in the 1600s. But not all cells are evil. Many of them are beautiful, and you should enjoy them.